Hello and welcome back to Jade Empire. When we last left off, well, we managed to um, find the flower of the fields. Yeah, I, I think that's going to go over very well. It looks like the soldiers have taken control from the bandits who normally rule here. I'm not sure it's an improvement. Noticed. Useless Marsh. I'm sick of flushing up bandits just so we can chase down some farm girl. I'd rather burn these reeds from... Look! Long more sword. bandits creeping into the camp! <laughs> what? Who? No, wait. I don't want any more trouble. Oh. You don't have any options to choose, friend. Fine, just tell me what I want to know. Yes, I can do that. Whatever you want. Where is Dawn Star? Where is Francis? No, wait. Different game. Who? The woman. She got loose from the sack and ran into the cave. Would have been safer out here with us. Oh. That cave is home to both toad demons and ogres. And both are in a foul temper from fighting over the space. Running in there is like moving from the claws to the fangs. I see. We refused to go after her, so Gao went himself. Hmm. Why did he kidnap Dawnstar? I don't know. He just said it was very important that he get her tonight. He brought a few groups of us over for it. We didn't take her. We made Gao do that himself. I know we shouldn't have let him talk us into any of this, but he doubled our pay. Mm. It was just one woman. Compared to some things, well, all I'll say is that this wasn't the worst thing done by a Gao lately. Sounds like. What do you mean by that? Look, that's all I can say. Just let me go. I won't be any more trouble for you. If I go back to Gao's father, I'll be killed as a failure. A reasonable punishment. Gao has some things right. By my grandfather, I won't get in your way again. I swear. <laughs> I'm not taking that chance. You're not going anywhere. Get out of here. I'll follow Gao into the cave. You are far too generous with your mercy. So, Thank someone you. definitely you prefers the closed fist. Fact. Yeah, we can't um, learn more about him. Oh. Got some bones somewhere around here. Ah, there they are. Inferior charm gem. And some money. And looks like we can't get into the house. Ah, but we can open up these casks. High focus increases your chance of avoiding damage by, from traps by evading. Good to know. So this is the swamp cave. And those would be ogres. Well, we did hear that they were pretty good against fire or weak against fire and flame. As Nathan Fillion shows. It's always someone else's fault, isn't it, Gao? This is your mess. I didn't make you kidnap me. 
<laughs> your friend is doing a good job of frustrating Gao into carelessness. That will work in your favor, but it also means we have to follow them by a different route. Noticed. Be careful. That means fresh enemies for us. These caves harbor strange creatures. Also noticed. Oh, that's the way back. Hello. Longsword. Dire blade. didn't take too bad. Money. And a trap. I guess that is the uh, collapse that Gawa the Lesser created. Nice going there, Mal. <laughs> And at least that looks like a roasting animal. Ogre cave. Okay. I never had cause to enter these caves. Gao will have to pay for this inconvenience. Noticed. Dire plane. Sleeping <laughs> tiger. <laughs> Swap the styles and style slots by holding down the slot you want to and change and select blah 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 blah. Style gain to a demon. Well, that'll be uh, definitely better than uh, Rhino. Oh, there we go. Let me guess, if I look at it, yep, Toad Cave. I swear, Dawn Star, my patience is running thin. No, no! Not Sup. you, anyone but you. What are you doing here? Assume my time in another errand all because of you. Chasing a fool. You think you'd get away with it, this? It seems Gao doesn't think much about anything. Hmm. Noticed. <laughs> I understand more than you. I did you a favor, but you are too stupid to know a good thing when you're in its grasp. Being kidnapped was a good thing? You have an odd view of what it takes to impress a woman. Fool! You'd be dead if it wasn't for me. Everything you had was gone. My father was into that. What are you talking about, Gal? You'll see. Death comes from above to ferret out your hidden master and his real name. Dawnstar was the only thing I wanted to save, and what thanks do I get? Nothing. So be it. I'll just kill you all and forget your pitiful little village ever existed. Uh-oh. What have you done, Gal? You'll see. You've already lost no matter what happens here. You'll see. I'll make you see. I really don't want to fight you again, Gal. You don't have a choice. I won't let you walk away this time. Okay.
Well, let's settle this gal one on one. Good. There's no master lead to restrict how I fight. I'll kill you in time to see the red sky over your village. Leaping tight, bots! <laughs> You might have had me slowed, but that wasn't Thank enough. For coming to my rescue. I'm not sure why Gal thought he would get away with this. He had to know that someone in the village would come for me. Although, I suspected it would be you. <laughs> yes, yeah, so I always get saddled with Master Lee's cast off chores. I would have done the same for any other student. Oh, well, your loyalty to us is very welcome. You wouldn't want this mess with Gao to disrupt our lessons. Mm-hmm. And who is this? I must thank your new acquaintance for his help as well. Sagacious Su, you don't owe me anything. I just helped your young friend through the swamp. Sagacious Su, well, I am grateful. I don't know what Gao meant by saying he was doing me a favor. How could dragging me here be beneficial? Um, empty threats, let him argue with the worms. I don't know, but I think we should head back to the village. Agreed. I want Master Lee to know that we are both safe. It's too bad, though. He wanted to reach Gao. I'm sure of it. Probably. Gao just seemed to get more and more bitter. He didn't respond well to discipline. It's too bad. Let's all just get out of here. Er. Yeah, I want to. It's obviously some chests back there, so. Yeah, Zoo, head for the entrance. I will wait by Gal's flyer. He can't object now. I guess. Gentle persuasion. Oh, let's enjoy a level up. Um. Yeah, balance that. Five more points. Um, yeah, let's uh, hmm. You know what? I already know I'm going to be using Fortune's Favorite a lot. And... I think that should be good for now. And it looks like Gao has been... Uh, Removed. Viper's Wit. Scholar's Gem of Fate. Well, that's nice. Let's recover. Eye of the Viper. Players found one of three skulls for the Viper's file. The scroll is part of a powerful gem that previously contained both the Iron Palm and Viper spot style. It was split as these two styles can never function in harmony. Interesting. Eye of the Viper. One of three meditation doctrines required to withstand the uh, physiological demands of training a Viper fighting style. The aspirant must possess and study all three before he or she can safely learn this unforgiving act. Viper corrupts the user's key to achieve, or achieve a toxic effect in an opponent, but if implied incorrectly, it's more dangerous uh, to the attacker. The aspirant must learn and see nerve clusters, not impact points. Hardened muscles can resist and reflect poisoned energy, leaving the untrained with an imbalance that could be fatal. Interesting. Hmm. Yeah, 
looks like that's everything. Hunt for Viper and hunt for request for Iron Palm. I think that's the only um, one that you have to really choose one or the other, but yeah, um, I don't know which one I'll go for. Although speaking of vipers, focus two, charm one. Sharp wit and mind are key to winning the hearts of people. Too many believe that looks and strength alone rule the day and then neglect to realize a mind will always triumph. One's wit and skill must always strike like a snake, taking the opponent by surprise. And yep, we are definitely heading towards the open palm. Much to this guy's what chagrin. To Gal's men? I thought they abandoned him, but it looks like we've had to fight them all. Yep. I didn't realize you took that much of a risk getting to me. Thank you. I don't want to fight them all, but there was no real choice. They chose their paths. I just happened to cross it. I enjoyed it. It was real, not like the gentle sparring at the school. Yeah, I didn't want to fight them. I heard Gal yelling at them to kill any bandits who might approach. I guess they wouldn't stop to ask questions. His mercenaries didn't seem too eager to follow me into the cave, though. It seemed like they were humoring him. Sounds like it. Maybe they were his father's men. I don't... Wait. Do you hear something? Uh-oh. That's... Not there a good so sign. Many. Where are they coming from? You should be more concerned with where they are going. Yeah. You may have won a victory over Gal the Lesser, but it looks like he put things in motion that have outlived him. Hmm. What? What do you mean? These machines have weapons. They drop casks that explode on impact. There will be soldiers on the ground as well. Uh oh. Was, was that what Gal meant? He said something about death coming from above for Master Lee. Well, that sounds about right. He kidnapped you so you wouldn't get caught into an attack? It doesn't matter. We have to get back. The students. Everyone will need our help. Mm hmm. Walk away, Dawnstar. You won't get there in time. Better to avert your eyes than see something you care about fall to ruin. Save yourself the pain. <laughs> That's your solution to everything. Just walk away. We have to try. There has to be a way. This... Machine of Gauss, do you know how to make it work? Could you fly it? I doubt there are two people in the Empire that know how they work. It's a baffling combination of magic and artifice. How do you know so much about it? I've seen this kind of attack before. The tools used are different, but it's the same kind of destruction. So you don't really know? If you actually cared about the safety of this machine, you wouldn't be about to fly it into a swarm of enemies. What guarantee do you want? <laughs> there is a handle attached to something like the reins of an ox yoke. You move it left and right, forward and back. It should swim through the air fairly smoothly. All right. So flying like a swimming ox, that helps. Will you come to help us, Zoo? You seem to have a good heart. If you are intent on returning, I will accompany you. I've already done more than I wanted, but I could not avoid this forever. <laughs> you are an interesting person, Sagacious Sue. Your eyes hold a great sadness that is oddly familiar to me, but I don't know why. Hmm. Well, I tried to understand his trouble, but he won't let me. Perhaps I am imagining it. We will discuss it another time. I hope we are not too late. Hopefully. We shall fly the swimming on.
Uh oh. But this is gonna be for next time. When we come back, I guess we're flying the swimming ox. Have a good one, folks.